Well, mother, daughter, and teacher, and teacher Kedra Freilich, not only beat ca brain cancer once, but twice. And this weekend, she will be having a fundraiser. New this morning, Aaron Fields is here with the man behind the fundraiser. And he's going to give us an update on how she's been doing. Good morning, Aaron. Good morning, Josh and Alicia. I'm here with Stan Scott. And good morning, Stan. Good morning. Okay, I just have to brag on Stan because there's a lot of people that have done stuff with Kedra, but every time I've done anything, you've been the man behind everything. So can you just kind of tell us um, how you met Kedra and the story behind that? Sure. Uh, two years ago, I didn't know Kedra. Um, my daughter and Kedra were friends through teaching together. And I just, I heard the story about Kedra and the cancer and, and just thought if, if this was my daughter, I'd want somebody to step up and kind of take control of the helping out with fundraising. So I just kind of took the bull by the horns and gathered a good team around me and went from there. How many fundraisers do you think you've like, oh, <laughs> I just need to brag on, he's done so much and like you need to get like. I, I think there's about eight or nine that we've done in total. We've done in Williston, Las Vegas, Fargo, Bismarck, Mandan. Um, but there's been people from all over the country that have donated, so it's, it's pretty awesome. That is incredible. And so um, talk about what's going on this weekend um, with the Valentine's Day. Well, um, we, di we didn't want to compete with the restaurants, so we didn't do it on the actual Valentine's Day. You know, restaurants are struggling enough. They, they need their support. But, so we did it on the 15th, which is Saturday. Um, and it's a prime rib dinner complete with all the fixings and, and uh, dessert. And it also comes with a bottle of wine for $65, uh, which is a pretty good deal. Um, so it's at Prairie West Golf Course. Um, we're having it catered. And um, so basically the idea behind it was to find a caterer, figure out a price, and then try to raise as much money for caterers as we can. So there's seatings at 4.30, 5.30, 6.30, and 7.30, but we're almost completely sold out now because over the weekend a whole bunch of people must have finalized their plans. And so we've got a few 4.30 tickets left and maybe a couple of 7.30. I have to get to the office and check. But that is such a great deal too, like you get like, your food and your wine, all for $65. Yep. I've had some friends that have spent like, don't even want to say how much they spent on right. like a Valentine's Day dinner, so that's yep. awesome. Yep. Um, but also, the money's not only going to Kedra, they're also like the Mandan cheerleading coach as well, right? Can you tell right. us a little yes. bit about that? Yeah, sure. Um, Courtney Pierce is the cheerleading coach in Mandan, and uh, she's got thyroid cancer. There's so many young people, and, and every day we're, we're hearing more about younger people that are developing cancer. So um, the cheerleaders from Mandan High will be doing the waitressing uh, of this event, and then any tips raised will actually go to Courtney. So we're actually benefiting two families instead of one. So it's double like the double whammy right there. Right. Like you're helping two people right yep, there. Absolutely. And I love that. Yep. Um, well, thank you so much, Stan. Um, and for more information, you can head to our KX page, kxnet.com. But Amber, how's the weather looking for this weekend? Is it going to be pretty good? Well, well, they're going to be inside, but you yeah, know. Yeah, I don't think you'll have any issues getting there. No uh, major systems looking to be moving through. And it looks like the temperature should moderate okay by then as well. But it's